Hey guys, I'm I'm really sorry about how the the lack of posting of actual talking videos. I know just posting, you know, posing updates gets boring. It gets boring as hell. I understand that. Um, it's just some reason, you know. I said I've already lost over 20 pounds in this prep, and I'm already feeling like really tired, and I just don't. I'm not feeling as energetic as I used to. I, I feel <clears throat> like it's getting harder and harder to like stay motivated in terms of like keeping the upload the uploads um, constant. You know, I, I said I apologize for that. You know, I don't. I'm not trying to, guys. I'm, uh, <clears throat> I'm trying to work through it. You know, I'm hoping I'm not sounding too damn weird right now. I'm hoping that, um, well, as I'm getting leaner, you know, I'm gonna try to get more and more motivated to keep these videos. I know you guys, you guys want to know like what's going on right now. How how am I feeling? Right now, I'm feeling just really tired, a little lethargic. Um, <clears throat> like honestly, I'm. I got to pull 415 for sets of seven today, and I'm just not where I need to be right now. <laughs> like mentally, I am just not there right now. But I'm going to. I'm going to. Just gotta keep, gotta keep being positive. Gotta keep working through it. You know, because I will. I will. I want to get it. You know. But I just want to let you guys know that it, 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 I'm not trying to just. I'm not forgetting about you guys. And I and I said I do understand posing updates. They're boring as hell. You know, to some people. You know, I mean, I'm going to post those once a week just because my posing needs a lot of work. And that's why I'm doing it. You know, not just to see the changes, just to help me with my posing because my posing needs a lot of work. Let's get lean, baby. Lean. So, anyways, guys, yeah, that was really weird. Um, I had a pretty good workout. Felt pretty damn good. 
little fatigue coming all coming along. I I don't know. It's like since I've lost 20 pounds, like I was telling you earlier, I just I've, I've been feeling like really like lethargic lately, and uh, the deadlifts just wiped me out. Like after doing four sets of seven, man, they were just oh they were killer, man. They were, it just killed me. But I mean, workout's over now. Feeling great. Um, had a little trouble with the uh, front office, man. Uh, as soon as the gym, as soon as I was finished with everything, right, one of the personal trainers came up to me because, you know, most of these personal trainers, they don't even lift. Uh, like, man, you look great and all, but it's like people don't come here to, you know, see somebody with their shirt off. I'm like, bro, I'm just, you know, I'm leaving the gym. I'm not working out with my shirt off, right? Um, and he's just like, man, he said, we'll get in so much trouble if you have your shirt off, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, you fucking kidding me? <laughs> oh, so, I mean, I don't, I don't really give a fuck what they think. You know, I'm going to do me. Didn't do anything wrong, guys. I mean, it's not, I mean, yeah, I look better than the personal trainers because most of the personal trainers that are fucking, their lack of knowledge just like makes me cringe makes me cringe hell I asked one of the personal trainers like apparently one of the top guys if he knew what progressive overload meant what it was uh oh uh, I don't know it's a fucking gold gym man I'm telling you man anybody could be a fucking personal trainer these days this is the damnedest thing I've ever seen damnedest thing you know I'm not trying to like be negative towards people but man you know that's bullshit threatening to kick me out of the damn gym stupid guys all right guys feeling good about to get something to eat and uh let the head out of here people are yeah, still looking at me yeah feeling good guys thank you guys so much for keep watching and i'll show you what i guys what i'm gonna eat about to get some groceries too so i'll show you a couple things that i get i'll be if my dad said you know the pops <laughs> About to get groceries, guys, with the dam. Ooh, found out why I was so tired. I literally had only like 80 carbs, and I eat, usually eat like three to 400 carbs before I actually train. So that's why I was so damn tired. Stupid, stupid. I feel better now. That carbs. <laughs> Say hello, Dan. Yeah, that's my inspiration right there, guys. Strong as spark. Maybe one day I'll have like a bench press that's half of his. <laughs> Maybe one day, guys, when my shoulder doesn't bug the hell out of me. Gotta pick up some creatine today, too. Yeah. Alright, guys. See you in the grocery store. Picking up the egg ones. Shopping stuff. It's weird, guys. I haven't had a real soda, quote unquote, like a regular Dr. Pepper, regular Coke, and so damn long that these diet sodas taste just like the real thing to me. It's weird. That's the same thing as all the energy drinks, everything. So, quick tip, you know, I mean, just don't drink sodas for a while. Say about a couple weeks, a month. Taste buds will change. Try, try Diet Coke. Hell, might work for you. It works for me. Is everything we got, guys? Look at it. Oh, God, this stuff. Whole bag of rice cakes. I may or may not put <clears throat> some Walden Farm syrup. Just depends. Just depends. We'll see how it goes. Actually, let's have, let's have a piece of um, That's good, guys. For some reason, 
I only had like 80 carbs this morning before I trained. I was wondering why I was being so damn tired. And I looked back at my notes, and hell, usually I have about 300 to 350 carbs before I train. So that's going to make some kind of difference. And now, just having all my carbs, it just it, it feels nice. It's really nice. <laughs> um, I'm not trying to say you can't train without having carbs. Just, I'm one of them guys that I love to have a shit ton of carbs before I train. I get really tired. Really tired. As you can tell probably earlier in the video, I was like a damn zombie. Oh. After a Diet Coke, training session, pre-workout. Feel good. Feel good. Freaking dad over here, he's chowing on some chicken. <laughs> so I ate the whole chicken. Tastes good, dad? <laughs> he's dieting right now, guys. He's like, he started at 237. It's about 229 right now. I got his macros that like, they combined to like 2,500 calories, something like that. It's like all these little coaches that he's hired. They're just a lot of them are full of shit. I'm just like, Dad, we gotta get you, gotta get you, you know, on stuff stuff that works. So that's what we're doing right now. He's gonna get down to about 200 pounds. Hopefully, he's a big dude. So 200 pounds with abs, look pretty damn good. But maybe like 40 pounds bigger than me. <laughs> Whatever. Whoa. Mm. Oh god. Alright guys, I think I'm going to conclude this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I said it was something different. Using a new phone. Finally talking back to the camera. Hopefully I'm not too damn awkward right now. Um, again guys, I'm striving every day to be the better version of myself. Still got a long ways to go. Long ways to go. But I appreciate all the support that you guys give me. You guys really help me to stay motivated, you know, or I wouldn't have made this video. And it's just, it's it's cool, you know, the people you guys actually like following my journey, and it, it, I said, it just means the world. Um, be looking out for some other cool videos that I'll be doing soon. So I'm going to keep getting the leader, keep losing weight, and sooner or later, guys, it'll be time. It'll be time to uh, get the shredded glutes, and I said, it's pursuit towards greatness for a reason. And it, <laughs> just, it's great, guys. Thank you guys. Take care and see you guys soon.